Bond is looking to leave Her Majesty's Secret Service and enter the employ of an organization whose deceased turtleneck wearing leader was obsessed with perfect systems, upending the status quo, and eventually taking over the world. No, not Spectre, Apple. 007 is no longer stopping wars, but on the verge of starting one between online juggernaut Amazon and its content rival, the house that Steve Jobs built. The lucrative film and television rights for the Bond series are up for grabs with production partner MGM looking for another studio to help them distribute and produce the series or films. Warner Brothers was already making moves to add the 007 franchise to their pantheon of properties, including the Anglophile favorite Harry Potter. Oh man, my Harry Potter and James Bond fanfiction could become a reality? <laughs> Apple's new executives hail from Sony's TV arm, and conceivably they're looking to branch Bond beyond the theatrical window that Eon Entertainment has been so protective of for decades now. Though this won't be Bond's first adventure on the TV as we fondly remember James Bond Jr. Why his nephew is his junior and he had to go live at a private school in the Alps leads us to believe that Mane Prane and Senior are keeping a secret love child secret from the secret love child. The double A's have their eyes on the double O, and now more than ever, they could really use the content as the Marvel Cinematic Universe, Star Wars, and DC are really eating up people's dollars. Amazon has found success with a grounded version of a Bond movie in the miniseries The Night Manager. Seriously, Tom Hiddleston ordering a vodka martini gave me all the Fleming feels in the series finale. The critical reception has been enough to make major spy rights holders stand up and take notice of the copious amounts of money they are missing out on. Almost a million dollars. Actually, realistically, we're talking in the billions of billions of dollars because that's the valuation that the bond rights are really starting to spark in this content-heavy atmosphere. But maybe that's the answer. Instead of spending all that money giving us new iterations of James Bond, maybe step to the left and produce fun content in the spirit of the spy we love, like Night Manager, Tinker Tailor, and even Kingsman. Now, who wants to fund my reimagining of the experts with John Travolta and Kelly Preston? In the meantime, we'll keep watch for whose gold finger has Bond under their thumb. I'm Brian, and this has been a WizPop Minute.